Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to another video and today I am really excited to share some wallets with you guys from a fantastic company known as OpenSea Leather. Uh, I reached out to them and asked if they could send me a wallet to review and they have a new style of wallet that they just released a few weeks ago. So we're going to be taking a look at that and then one other wallet that they've had on the market for a little bit longer. And even though OpenSea Leather did send these wallets to me, they did not pay me to say any of this. All these thoughts are my own. Um, so just wanted to throw that out there. Now, in case you guys have never heard of Open Sea Leather, um, everything is made in the USA, made in Honolulu, Hawaii, and they have a great team over there at Open Sea Leather. Uh, Michael Bluth, the owner, was one of the first companies to send me something to review for free. Really, really always helps out the channel when these companies are able to help small creators like me. It means a huge, huge deal, um, and uh, you know, everyone I deal with over there is just absolutely awesome. So, now that we got that out of the way, let's take a look at these wallets. All right, so the first wallet we're going to be taking a look at, this is the Top Cider Mini. Now, if you guys have never heard of just the regular Top Cider, it is basically a cash focused uh, card wallet, if that makes sense. But this is the mini version, so this one is more focused on the card aspect rather than the cash. So this wallet is very, very straightforward and very, very easy to kind of operate. You just open up this flap here, you load your cards right here in this pocket back here. So uh, I have seven cards in there, fits great. It's a little snug at first just because it's brand new leather, but it will definitely break in. And then cash is super easy. You just fold it up into threes and you can just slide it in the back or you can even slide it right up here in this front area. But this you know, dollar bill is kind of limp. So we're just gonna slide that in the back there and then it just closes up like this. And that's your wallet, super sleek, nice and modern. What I love about OpenSea leather wallets is they are the perfect example of there's beauty and simplicity. I mean, this wallet is just stupid simple. It's literally just one, you know, one piece of leather folded a couple times like origami and then sewn on the sides. Um, it's just a great, great, great minimalist wallet made from fantastic materials. And as you can see, the workmanship is absolutely fantastic on this. Great stitching on here. Really nice, clean logo, minimal branding all the way around. This thing is just absolutely stellar. You can see the, you know, the, um, the, you know, the stretch marks from the cowhide. And this is in the whiskey color. Just a great, beautiful color. This will patina absolutely amazing. So, and what I love about this kind of folded design is you can always grab like your most used card and you can always put that right up here just so it's separate from the other ones. So now I have six cards back here, one in the front and then cash in the back. It's just such a good design. And in case you guys were wondering, this is the regular top cider next to the mini top ciders. As you see, it's just a little bit less wide because the top cider is meant to carry cash inside. So you put your cards in and it can fit full bills in there. And the full bills can actually stand all the way up to here and you can just fold everything you know, just very, very easy. So you can literally open it. All your cash is already unfolded. You can skip through it, pull your bill out and close it up like that. So that's kind of your size comparison. Now this regular top cider I've had for about four years and I, obviously it's in the black and white. And as you see, it has great patina. It's not super worn in, but you can see it's definitely got some patina on it. It's definitely worn in. You can see the indentation of my cards there and it's just a fantastic, fantastic design. And if we take a look on his website here, the Top Cider Mini, it goes for $54. And there is a ton of different leather colors to choose from. You got whiskey, chestnut, mahogany, green, Bordeaux, violet, red, turquoise, just so many different options, so many thread colors, and so much customization that you can do with these wallets. It's absolutely phenomenal. Um, you get made in USA, really high quality, made by actual people's hands uh, with all these different colors and combinations for 54 bucks. I mean, you really, really can't go wrong. So that is a look at the Top Cider Mini. Let's take a look at the next one. All right, now the next wallet we're gonna be taking a look at, this is called the MK1. And this is a very, very different wallet for OpenSea Leather because his kind of niche, his kind of shtick has always been these, you know, flap wallets, these very, very simple, you know, origami style wallets like the Top Cider, the Gun Deck, um, you know, the Hubei, all these different kinds of wallets that are just, they kind of stick to the same, you know, general pattern. Now this is a very, very different wallet for him because this is a specifically card minimalist wallet style 
wallet with a integrated leather pull tab. Now, the reason why that's so good is because leather is a lot more strong than let's say fabric or even elastic, which a lot of pull tabs are made from. So they're bound to um, snap, rip, break over time. Now this is literally two different um, you know, pieces of leather that are sewn together. So you have the inner layer and you have the outer layer. So the inner layer is where the pull tab is built into, as you can see there. And what's really cool is you can choose two different colorways for this wallet. And we'll, you know, we'll see that when we look on his website and, you know, all the pricing and everything. But let's just kind of take a look around this wallet and just show you guys how just beautiful it is. So this is the Whiskey on Whiskey. As you see, I'm a huge fan of the whiskey color of, uh, you know, from Open Sea Leather. It's just a beautiful color. And um, you have this really nicely sewn on the sides, um, just minimalist card wallet. And uh, this is the saddle stitching. They also offer another kind of stitching called cross stitching where it's kind of goes around and goes on the outside of it. I like the look of the saddle stitching, so that's what I went with. Super clean text on there, very minimal branding. I absolutely love it. It's just such a clean design. Um, and as you guys can see, this isn't straight out of the box um, or straight out of the package. I've been using this for a couple days, and as you see, it already has some great patina. It's starting to glisten. It's already formed to my cards, and it's just, man, I really, really enjoy this wallet. Um, so, and you can kind of see here how the how the pull tab mechanism works. I mean, he literally just cut, cut, snip, snip, and you basically have a pull tab. It's just so genius. So let's load this thing up with some cards and show you how it looks. So he has said multiple times uh, that this is a card only wallet, that it's not really meant to carry cash. I still like to have a couple bills on me, at least one or two. So kind of how I do it here is I actually just, you know, I put my, you know, my cash, uh, I fold it up into threes and I just kind of sandwich it between uh, some cards because it's not cash I use all the time. Um, so that I just kind of sandwich it there. So at least I have it on me. And then I just kind of slide that into the middle pocket where the um, pull tab is. I put my two most used cards on this side. This is my debit card and my credit card. And then on this side, I put my other two most used cards as well. So that's kind of how my wallet is loaded up. As you see, fits everything really well. It's not too tight, it's not too loose. It looks super, super clean. You have really, really good looks on this thing. And the pull tab, absolutely flawless and it's only going to get smoother over time because that you know that leather is going to wear in but as you see right now it's already super easy to operate just like that you can easily push up on your cards with your thumb or you can pull them out like this one at a time so right now on his website you can get the mk1 for 79 dollars i think that's a really good deal and the most apparent reason is because you can customize this thing to the absolute limit. So as you see here, he has a bunch of different color combinations, you know, because before I said there's two different layers of this wallet. So he has whiskey with the green, he has black on black, he has that like olive uh, Pueblo color with the natural leather, you have the whiskey with the blue. So many different color combinations here, as you see there, so many. Here's some rough dimensions for you, two and a half inches by four inches. There's a top sider, there's a top sider mini, and the MK1. That's, you know, these are his two newest designs. So you can get it with a grommet or no grommet, and then you can get the uh, cross stitching or the saddle stitching. The one I have is the saddle stitching, obviously. So many different color combinations. He offers this wallet in his uh, Horween leathers, also kangaroo leathers. I, I've just, I've, I've never seen a company offer this much customization, and it's 80 bucks. It's an $80 wallet. You get made in the USA by actual people's hands. You get so much customization, high quality leather, high quality stitching, or high quality thread, I mean, for 79 bucks. It's such a good deal. I just love it. So that is a look at the MK1. Absolutely love it. Probably one of my favorite designs from Michael and his team over at OpenSea Leather. Just a fantastic quality wallet. I absolutely love that he kind of stepped out of his comfort zone and did something like this. It's just, it absolutely paid off. This thing is absolutely awesome. 
and I will definitely try to make a kind of a you know a follow-up video to this and show you guys how it patinaed uh, over a couple months. Uh, I'll you know maybe I'll do just like a you know a quick little couple minute video in a few months just to show you guys how well this thing is patinaed because I'm gonna de I'm definitely gonna be using this thing for the long haul. It, I absolutely love this design. It just it just works. It just works so well. So yeah, I'll definitely do an update video on this little guy. All right, guys, well, that is going to do it. Again, big shout out to OpenSea Leather for sending these wallets along for a review. It really, really helps me out. It just really, really appreciate it. Um, I will have these linked in the description for your convenience if you would like to go check them out. I highly, highly recommend them, but that's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Stay humble. Peace.